Hi, I'm Arthur. And I'm Andrea. And we are Heavy the Metal, Metal Beer, Beer Club. Club. And we just recently visited Phantom Carriage Brewery in Carson, California. And they have a great horror theme, so stick around. We're going to tell you all about it. Music! If you follow us here at Heavy Metal Beer Club, then you know that we are huge horror fans. I want to live inside a Halloween scene. And so when we found out about this place, Phantom Carriage Brewery in Carson, California, uh, it was a must visit. I saw it online and I said, we have to go there. I looked up the place and said, we got to go. So now all of you are going to hear about this place and you have to go too. And when we got there, there's a giant skeleton Oh when, even before it you get to so the entrance, cool. that. Yes. It just got cooler as we went in. Now, we didn't confirm, but uh, I believe it being a horror-themed place, that it is named after the 1921 movie silent film, Phantom Carriage, uh, which was also a it book. It is, because I read it online <laughs> the other, before we went. Ah, okay. So, yes. It, that, it, they have it d decorated. It looks like a movie set. It looks like a place you just want to hang out if you like horror films and Halloween. It's fantastic. Now, to pull off a tasting room with a horror theme, you better have the beer to back it up. Right. Otherwise, you don't want to come off right. like one of those kiddie yeah. pizza playgrounds. Yeah. And uh, Phantom Carriage delivered. Oh my gosh, yeah. the beers are fantastic. They're very unique. They're as unique as the style of the brewery. It's so awesome. And, uh, yep. The names of the beers were fantastic. <laughs> the descriptions of the ingredients. Now, something that I wish we could have done is had a flight, but flights weren't available right now at this time. Uh, most beer breweries can't right now, but soon they will, and then we can taste them all. We each ordered our own beers so we could taste two different beers and then taste each other's beers. Right. I had one called La Planchada Origen, which is a Vienna style lager. And uh, it was slightly hazy, a uh, little bit lighter in color, but I wouldn't say completely light. The description was toasted almond with uh, platinum blossom, but uh, which you could taste a little bit of the almond, but what really stood out was an anise flavor, uh, black licorice, it had sort of a, a light absinthe yeah. flavor to it. And that one uh, was a 5.5 alcohol by volume. I'd definitely drink that again. Oh yeah, no doubt. I loved it, I really did. And I had the Violet Shadow Rhubarb Saison, which was fantastic. It was a 6.3 and percent beer and it tasted like it had rhubarb and cucumber and mint. Very unique, again, uh, fantastic flavor. We're going back. And also they had food available, and we didn't try any of their food. Yes. And then the sandwiches, they call house smoked hand witches, like spelled like a witch, which is pretty fun. I mean, everything. I'm sure if they're sandwiches that with the smoked meats as good as the beer, you're not going to go wrong with whatever you think. As you walk throughout the entire place, there's great horror artwork all over the walls, but Every it's room. all fun. Yeah, everything is Different kind of all sitting together. Rooms. Yeah, from the the old style classic monsters of of Dracula and Frankenstein's yeah. monster to The Shining and Jack Nicholson on. Oh the wall. yeah, one of my favorites. I, it was awesome. I, we can't. You've got to go there and see this. You've got to see it. Yeah, you have to see it for yourself, most definitely. And it was just the right touch of a lot of the the horror elements with everything on the walls. And then uh, the lighting was great too. Yeah, yeah, it was. It has it was that dark. set the mood, made but, you very relaxed and comfortable. But there wasn't so much to where it came off cartoonish and and jokish. No, I mean, not it's, at all. It, it no. yeah, it's it's a legit. Yeah. A very legit. You it can was, tell there. It was a great vibe. Just very, just kind of spooky if you like that kind of thing. And it's just super cool. And then they had a huge tasting room, which was a lot of fun. They had a big screen in there. The music that was playing yeah. was great. There were a lot of barrels lining the entire room, and it was very cool. And a lot of them, most of them, were full. They told us with oh, beer, so they were I putting love, a lot of beer. I love barrel-aged beer, so we'll definitely be back. But they had a smaller room where they had that big picture of Jack Nicholson and uh, from The Shining, and uh, that would be great for a small party. Even the hallways 
On yeah. the way to the restroom, they had a, a medium-sized room there. More music playing and hands coming out. It was so cool. You'll see it. And then they have the screening room. Screening room. The screening room, they show new movies that people bring to them. So, you know, if you've got some great new movie that you'd like to have a viewing party, talk to them at the brewery and see if you can get yourself hooked up to play it in there. It couldn't be any cooler of a place to see a screening of a movie. Did they say that? Uh-huh. Oh, I didn't know that. And outside they have this huge patio that has a coffin. Oh, well, it's actually, they call it their coffin patio. And uh, they have, uh, uh, at night, they'll put up a screen out there yep. and play movies as well. Yeah, it was a cool patio. Pumpkins, they have jack-o'-lanterns, so cool. Oh, and we also want a special thanks to Randy for uh, answering our questions and yeah. he showed us around. He, he took us, us a lot of the rooms were closed off, but he took us in there so yeah. we could check them out. Very cool, Randy. And Esmeralda, our beer tender, she was awesome. She told us about the beers, gave us a sample. So if you like spooky Halloween, horror movies, and great craft beer, you've got to go to Phantom Carriage. And we want to thank those who have subscribed to the Heavy Metal Beer Club for your continued support. We really appreciate it. <laughs> it knocked me over. Yeah, thank you for your support of the Beer Club. We love you guys. We're going to keep going to more fun places like Phantom Carriage. Now that we can get out and around some more, we're going to go to a lot of fun places. And if you like this sort of content, please hit the like button and subscribe. And set the bell because you don't want to forget that our show is on. Oh, we got a show on my shirt. Look at my cool. Oh, yeah. Put me in shot. Put me in shot. Merch. Yeah, merch. They had a Phantom great. Carriage. Merch. Yeah, they had a great merch table. All kinds of cool stuff. Oh, their gosh, glasses. Yeah, yeah their uh, hoodies. Love their logo. We both got a t shirt. Yeah. They had beanies, glasses, a lot of cool stuff fun things to remind you of the brewery that you're going to love so much. Yeah, that's definitely going to be a regular stop when we go back. Mm -hmm. And thank you so much for joining us here at Heavy Metal Beer Club. Cheers to you. Drink responsibly, stay safe, and don't, don't forget, forget to, to stay metal. Today we're talking about truly hard seltzer. <laughs> Get yourself a pack.